Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mike Fur 22 coming back at you with some pickups, man. Got four pickups today. Uh, two of them are T-shirts. Two of them is a pair of shoes. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Y'all know what released today. is four shoes released today. LeBron's, KD's, Kobe's, and those uh, Dion's. So, I'm going to just get right into my video and uh, show y'all what I got. First off, I'm going to start off with the cheese. I'm going to start off with the t-shirts. I'm going to go with this one. Uh, last release for the uh, Summit Lakes, I wore my, con I wore my not concords, I wore my aquas. And everybody's like, oh, shit, he got on aquas, he got on aquas, he got on aquas. So I found this tee because I'm about to pull them back out again. Probably pull them back out this weekend. The aquas. Aqua 8s. I thought this tee was real dope. This is my first time seeing this tee. Black with the um, Aquaman and purple in the corner. thought that was real dope. The only thing about it I don't like that this t-shirt retailed for $40. But you know me, discount. So I didn't pay that much. I didn't pay $40 for it. I paid maybe like $28, $30, 32 something like that for it. But that's one t-shirt. I might rock it with these uh, camo LRG shorts that I picked up, like a wood line LRG G shorts. Um, I think these are like 60 bucks. You know, I might rock it with that, with the aquas. You know, that's one fit that I'm thinking about rocking together as a, a unit. All right, next t-shirt I got, it's going to be a quick video today. Um, Got a lot of stuff to catch up on, so it's gonna be real quick. The next video I got, I mean, video next pickup I got is this t shirt right here. It says, Can't Stop My Shoe Game with the uh, Nike. Can't Stop My Shoe Game, size 3X, uh, House of Hoops, $25 t shirt. You know what I'm saying? Nice little shirt. If you can, if you can. Guess what shoes I got, then you already know what kind of style shoe that is with that mint green. So first of all, the first pickup tennis shoe is a size 13 LeBron 9 Low. The Le LeBron 9 Low definitely fits different from the LeBron 9 mid top shoe. Totally different feel. I said, well, let me try a 13 on in it. They had a 14, but I was like, let me try a 13 on in a low, because I know low top shoes tend to look pretty longer. So I didn't want to get a 14. So I tried on 13 and fit perfect. Fit perfect enough for me with the insole in to, to cop a 13 in a LeBron 9 low. Uh, these retail for $150, $10, $10 less than, uh, than the, uh, the high tops. You know me, discount, got them for like 120 and some change. So, with that being said, let's get into the pickups. These are the shoes right here. These are LeBron 9 Easters, low tops. Dope sneaker, man. Real dope. I love the colorway. I actually have some, some cargo shorts that's this, this exact mint green colorway upstairs that I'm going to rock with that gray t-shirt I just showed. Because the... The shoe looks like a gray, but it's got like a kind of fluorescent type sheen to it. So it's kind of like a gray in like trans, not I don't say translucent, but like a luminescent is the word I'm looking for. A luminescent type glow to it when it hits different parts of the light. Real dope sneaker. Got the LeBron crown, LJ crown logos on the back. Got a 360 Air Max unit, which I love. I think they should have did the high tops like this. Um, different bottom. Got the LeBron uh, LJ crown on the bottom. Got the little chain link fence. Excuse me, if y'all could, if y'all can't see it, something going on with the camera on my computer. If y'all can't see it good, I apologize. I'm shooting this from my iPhone, so you know it is what it is. So. That's what's up, man. LeBron 9. Inside the sock liner. Inside the sock liner is a mint green. Got the LeBron James logo on the inside with a darker mint green 
mint green lockdown straps, um, gray laces. Wish they would have came with an extra pair of laces, but they didn't. But oh well, they're still a dope sneaker. Uh, no 3M on this shoe. All kind of hyperfuse technology on the side. Um, uh, like a pastel mint green uh, Nike swoosh on the side. Real nice sneaker, man. I, I, I did these like, I dig these. These are, these are tough. I wasn't getting these. I wanted the KDs, but they didn't have a size 14 in the KDs. And when I seen the LeBrons and tried them on, the way that light just was hitting them inside House of Hoops and it was just popping, I had to scoop them, man. I just had, I had to get them. Then they gave me a military on them, so I couldn't pass. All right, so that's that. That's those pickups. The next pickup I have is a sweet pair of shoes to me. I've been wanting this shoe for a long ass time. Uh, it's not a KD. It's the Dion. It is a Nike. Nike Air Diamond Turf 2. Colorway is varsity red, white, metallic gold, and black. Retail for 120 I paid $96 for them. No flexing. I'm not gonna show my receipt today. Y'all know how I get down. Um, military discount on these as well. These are the Dion's. Dope, man. Look how that. Whew. It's dope. These shits is mean, man. But nobody's standing outside in line for these. But I guarantee you, by the end of this day, there won't be no big sizes left in this shoe. Because everybody couldn't cop. Everybody couldn't cop the LeBrons. Or the KDs, like a lot of people that was in the lineup where I was at, South Lake Mall, Atlanta, they was lined up for the KDs. Like everybody wanted the KDs. Nobody wanted LeBrons. They got an ass. They got an ass of these LeBrons. A lot of them motherfuckers. Like House of Who's got like a hundred pair of motherfuckers probably. They got a lot of a lot of sizes, man. But they probably won't make it through the end of the weekend. But these motherfuckers is the hardest. Out of all that was released this weekend, these Dion Sanders are the best release of the weekend, in my opinion. In my opinion. And nobody was on these, because why? They were not hyped. That's what I love about a non-hype shoe that's tighter than a shoe that motherfuckers been hyping up for months. No one hyped this shoe up. It was anticipated, but it wasn't hyped like an instant sellout. Like, I was the only motherfucker in the line that bought these shoes. The only one that bought some Dion. I like, let me get Dion in size 13. When they was passing out tickets, he was like, oh, you good. You ain't got to worry about no tickets for the Dion. Ain't nobody bought, buying no Dion. I was like, shit, I'm going to get mine. I'm going to go ahead and secure my pair now. Because when I, motherfuckers going to regret. It's the same way they did when them red Griffey, Air Max Griffey ones came out. Motherfuckers slept on them, and people started buying them and copping them and rocking them. And they was like, damn, I should have got them. Now they're impossible to find without paying at least 200 something dollars for them. Bottom of them, check it out, got the old school Nike Air embossed on the back, the field goal and the home plate logo. Um, Tom says, Air Diamond Turf 2, Nike Diamond Turf 2, excuse me. Strapped, me, I like to rock mine unstrapped like that. This how, this how if you see me on the streets, this how I would rock mine. This, this strap right here is not as flimsy as the one from the Diamond Turf ones. It's kind of like stiff, so it'll stay in place. It ain't going to flap all down like the one Diamond Turf one. Of, that shit will flap down like that while you're walking with it unstrapped. This one got a, got a little weight to it. A dope shoe, man. This how it looks strapped. Strapped up. Nike out on the side. Got a little hits of gold. This was the shoe that Dion wore in 1994. With the 49ers, this was Dion's shoe. Then the next year, he went switched over to the Cowboys and won a Super Bowl with the Cowboys. He won two Super Bowls in two years with two different teams. Dion, the man, I'm actually waiting on the shirt from the freshness to come with these, to rock these, set these motherfuckers off. But like I say, man, it's your boy Mike Fur 2-2. That's my pickups for the day. I appreciate all my supporters. All uh, my followers, y'all can follow me on Twitter at MikeFerg409, that's M-I-K-E-F-E-R-G-409, that's my Twitter uh, tag name, uh, I'm on Facebook, 
Michael International, Shawty Ferguson. Um, that's it, man. You can catch me on Facebook, Twitter. Mainly Twitter because I'm trying to veer away from the Facebook. I just use Facebook for, like, personal family, like, putting pictures and stuff up for, like, my personal immediate family to see because it's easier than sending a text to everybody. So that's all I got, man. It's your boy Mike Fur 2-2. Holla at your boy. Peace.